I'm Caitlin O'Dell with the Hitchcock Taylor School District and today I'm showing you a presentation on basketball. Basketball. Basketball became a sport in 1936 when basketball first started originally two teams of nine players made up the ba basketball game. A number that was based on the standard number of players on a baseball team. Later, the teams were reduced to five players on the court at a time. The first basketball hoop were peach baskets with the bottom on it. The first string nets were used in the early 1900s. There are three main divisions of basketball, high school, college, and NBA and WNBA. High school basketball. High school basketball is probably the most watched high school sport. Although it is not as fun to watch as college or the NBA, there are a lot of injuries in the sport of basketball, but here are a couple of some of the most common ones. Torn ACL, ankle sprains, jammed fingers, knee injuries, deep thigh bruising, facial cuts, foot fractures, and then here is just a picture of us at the 281 tournament last year. And then here are just some pictures. College basketball. College basketball is the next step after high school basketball. The first men's college basketball tournament was held in 1939 with only eight schools compared to now as 68 teams participate in the college basketball tournaments. 35 schools have won the national championship. There are 346 Division I college basketball teams and only about 10% of that have been selected to play in the national championship have actually won. Only once have all four number seeds won their regional. This happened in 2008 when Memphis, UCLA, North Carolina, and Kansas made it or won the regional. Three individuals have won the national championship, both as a player and a coach, and that includes Joe B., Bob Knight, and Dean Smith. The University of Cincinnati and Ohio State University are the only schools from the same state to play for the tournament championship. NBA. NBA stands for National Basketball Association. A lot of kids dream to be professional basketball players, but very few actually make it to the NBA. People from all around the world come to play for the NBA. If you are a great basketball player, you can get admitted into the Hall of Fame, and NBA started in June 6, 1946. And here are just some pictures of some college, NBA, and high school teams. Why you should go out for basketball. It's fun, it gets you in shape, it's very competitive, you get lots of bruises, and lastly, you can meet lots of new people and have fun while doing it. Basic rules of basketball. There are five people on a court at a time on each team. You can't shove around other players. You can get fouls by hitting pushing, slapping, holding, and illegal screen, and those are just some of them. You can get fouls for much more. You have five seconds to pass the ball into the court on a jump ball or any ball that is dead or got knocked out of the court. You can't run with the ball without dribbling it. Okay, thanks for watching. I encourage you to give basketball a try. It is really fun and it's just a great sport to try. So thank you for watching and have a nice day.